Hi, in this video of WCF, we will discuss about the bindings available in WCF. As we have already covered the concept of the ABC of WCF, which told about the address binding and contract, and we got to know that binding is one of the very essential component of the endpoints, and without which we cannot create the endpoint for a WCF service. So let's see what this binding is all about. So basically binding will tell you a couple of things. The first thing is the transport protocol which you are going to use whether it's an HD protocol, TCP protocol, MSMQ, which kind of protocol you are going to work with and the encoding you are using for exchanging the messages. And the next thing is the security requirement. That is if you want to put any SSL layer or any SOAP encoding or not. All right, so these are the things which any endpoints will tell for a WCF service. Let's see what all bindings are available. We are not going to cover all the bindings, but yeah, we will cover some of the essential bindings which are very much in use in WCF. So like basic HTTP binding, WS HTTP binding, we have the different flavors of HTTP binding. Obviously, they would be having some differences which we will discuss while implementing these bindings. So this WS, that is Web Services HTTP binding. This one is very much compatible and interoperable with the ASP.NET Web Services. So if you have any older version of ASP.NET application and you want to create a service for that particular website, you can go for the WS HTTP binding. It will be very much compatible with the ASP.NET Web Services. Uh, net named pipe binding, net MSMQ that is Microsoft message queuing binding, net TCP in case you are working with any Windows based application you can go for the net TCP binding and net HTTP binding again the, one of the different flavor of the HTTP binding itself. So these are some of the famous bindings as I said like by the time we will start the implementation we will cover the different kinds of binding and we'll discuss about the particular binding which we are using in a great detail. So that is all about this video.